Hi everybody, today I'm going to show you how to make a card that opens like this. It's just a little neat fold. I call it a twist turn fold, but there may be another name for it, I'm not sure. The cupcake image and the birthday image are both from a set at squigglefly.com called Jane's Bakery. And it, there's a few other images and sentiments in that set too. Alright, so I'm going to show you how to make this card. You get an eight and a half by five and a half piece of cardstock, and then you're going to score your. I've got a piece here that's pre-scored, but you're going to score it two and three quarters inches in from the left edge, and then you're going to go over and score it four inches over from the left edge. So you would score it at two seven five and then you would score it at four. Then you're going to turn it this way and find your center and score all the way from the right end to your very first score line. Then you're going to flip it over and score the rest of that center line up to the first score line. You, do, you flip it over because this is going to be a valley fold a mountain fold, a mountain fold, and this one is a mountain fold. And that's why you flip it over because it helps you turn your fold your folds the correct way. Then you're going to make a score line from the top of this score to the bottom of this score line and then in from the top of this one to the bottom of this one. Once you have that all done, go ahead and fold your mountain folds and then fold your valley fold which is going to go up to this first score line and then you can turn it over and fold on your mountain fold then do your same thing with your diagonals and it helps if you use a bone folder to get those scores really nice and crisp then after you've got them folded, your card's going to kind of fall into place on its own. Just fold this valley fold down and let these diagonal lines push in, and it'll just flip over and form its own little card. And I've got uh, another one that I've already done so that we can decorate it. Put my tape on it. And... We'll set this on our square. We'll put our sentiment on. And there you have a cute little birthday card that you can give to somebody. Of course, it doesn't have to be a birthday card. It could be any kind you want. But pretty simple. A half piece of sheet of cardstock. Score it two and three quarters. Score it four inches. Find the center this way. Score all the way to your first score line. Flip it over. Score from the center to that first score line. Make your diagonal scores. Fold this in and it will pop into place pretty easy. So I hope that you find that helpful and that you make a few of these. They're quick to do. Super fast, super fun, and don't forget to visit Squigglefly. Thanks.